Hey, good morning, good morning. Just got the phone with a young man here in Georgia. You know I'm in Georgia. Hey, he's saying, yeah, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm spending, I'm, I'm, I'm buying and selling three cars a month, man. Sometimes four cars a month. You know, and I'm, 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 I'm paying 175 per car title fee. You know, that's four, five hundred dollars a month. I said, yeah, yeah, that's, that's true. That's true. How long you been doing this? About five, six months. So, oh, okay, okay. So, this guy calls me up. He's complaining about the fact that he's paying 175 per car title, and he's doing three, four cars a month. He's making three, four thousand dollars a month. He's saying off of cars, not bad. But my point is, he's not in touch with his power. He's complaining. Instead of thinking about, instead of just tweaking his perspective, wow, I'm doing three, four cars a month. That's one seventy-five per title. I'm paying the dealer. Hmm. Let me see if I can get my own license for that kind of money. And if he would have come to me, I would have told him, hey, you can get a deal license in Georgia for a few thousand. You get you an office-based location, three, four hundred dollars a month. You see, so his cost would be lower to have his own license. That's creatorship. A person who takes a situation that's not so ideal and finds a solution because there's always a solution that is better and gives you more power and control over that dynamic. That's what a create. Then that's 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 my, that's part of my thing, you know. Not just buying and selling cars. Yeah, you know that's that's fun and making money. For some of us, that's our passion. For some of us, it's our livelihood. Some, you know, it's a part-time hobby. But here, I want to also talk about mindset. Going from a complainer to a creator. That's what we're here. That's that's what we're here to do, to be leaders in our own life. To be leaders in the life of our family. I'm not just not talking about men here, men, women, whatever. If you're a leader, if you're head of household, if you are in charge of children, if you're in charge of your own life, then you're a leader. So for, for a leader to be effective, you have to have the right mindset to create opportunities when they're not visible to the masses to create control and dominance over your own financial situation that's leadership to grow your financial dominance and control and not be dependent upon outside forces that's leadership to find a way when there's no way that's leadership. Or are you going to complain? You see, so we're here to take leadership of our own lives and take leadership of the life of our families who depend upon us for emotional and financial stability and support and growth so we can leave legacy, you see? So you can't do that as a complainer. You, you, you can't. You have to be a creator. You have to take the friction that life gives you because life doesn't give it to you. You create friction for your own growth. Think about that. You want to go here? And you're thinking about going here? You only can go there through friction and growth. So you put that intention out. And life will give you back the tension and growth that's required to get you to this point. So you have to pay to get here. So you're paying with growth. And that growth is usually painful and harsh sometimes. That's your payment. But you're here now, you see? And that's really, that's everything, not just business. That's in life, that's in raising children, that's everything. Let's go from complainers to creators. Tweak your mindset that the friction is there to make you stronger, to force you to tap into your power. Scientists tell us we only use 7% of our brain power. That's not a lot. That's not a lot at all. So if we only use the 7% of our brain power, how much of our power are we using? Our ability to create something from nothing. Let's make money.